Hey everybody, and welcome back again. Uh, right, so I'm back in camp now. I'm gonna go and see Sadie Edler. No idea, I can't remember off, to off the top of my head where this mission sort of uh, finishes. So it might be a case of I'll just get this done in this, uh, this part and I'll go and see Charles in the next one. Uh, whilst I am here though, I'm gonna get rid of that. If you guys could leave a like, a comment and subscribe as well. That would be great. Okay, let's go see Sadie. Mrs. Ed. You okay? <coughs> Peach. You sure? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? The whole goddamn place full of people bickering, fighting and lying. It makes me real sad. I know. I need someone to ride with me. Do what? Finish off them O'Driscolls. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. I don't have it in me no more. I saw a calm swing. I... I just don't care. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me. And to my husband? You're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. Eh, no, I can't say no. I'll tell you what. I'll do it. But there's something you could help me with. Abigail. Jack. John. Make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes... Or how do you mean... When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean, help them escape when I... You know, you and me, we're more ghosts than people. But them, they, they could... I know. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? No, I'll go now. Get it over and done with. Thanks, Arthur. Okay. Come on. <clears throat> yeah, I think Sadie is one of the few people in this group that doesn't completely lose their mind. And the mere her and Charles, I think, are the only ones who actually get out of all this uh, hey. unscathed. Hey. Uh, well, so to speak. I think there's a bunch of them in there, mostly drunk. One of them is a fat fellow with a beard. Him? He's mine. Sure. How are we doing this? Look here, Steve, where are we? Okay, we're on the other side of the map. Fair we're enough. We're just going in. <clears throat> okay, then. Yeah, because this looks like a sound it's plan. A big branch, run down, lots of folk there, but spread pretty thin. I'll set it off and then we'll, we'll take it from there. Take it from there? Okay. So, no real plan then? Oh, I got a plan. Now come on. Wait, she's from Dutch's gang. Come on! Okay, dynamite worked pretty well. Well, the scope didn't help him too much.
Oh, she's having a bail of a time. I'm just gonna loot the l loot. I keep saying loot. I don't know why. Loot. I'm gonna loot the body. Let's see if I can get any ammo. Yeah, maybe nine bullets is a bit much to you know, load into a revolver. Uh, there's one guy left, where is he? Oh, I fell off. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Oh, this is... This is ridiculous. Where the hell is he? Oh wow, she uh, certainly cleared things up here. Jakey. We was always sweet on one another. I'm sure. Yeah. I miss him every day, every moment. Oh, they turned me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him. They still pure. Mm. I ain't even got that. <laughs> Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> we, uh, we should get away from her. I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, might want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur. <sighs> um, hmm. This only took like eight minutes, so. Let me get the map up. Uh, yeah, horse is there. Now where is the nearest town? Uh, it's either Valentine or Strawberry. Uh, strawberry, yeah. I might be able to buy some ammo there too. Yeah, I'm gonna take that to Van Horn and then ride up and go and see Charles. This is, this is only like taking me what, like eight minutes maybe? Yeah, fine. Yeah. Ah! A 
And now starts the very long journey to Strawberry. Oh, great. That's sick. That didn't go too badly. Now, come on. Uh, please tell me I'm not going to be jumped again by more animals. Next thing I know, a bear is going to come out and get me. So I don't think there's too much left of the game now. I'm surely coming up to the ending. Uh, I'm pretty close to it, I'd say. After Charles. Uh, I can't remember any big events happening after that. Okay, after we want to see Charles, I think we bust the eagle flies. No, actually, no. What am I on about? We attack, uh, yeah, there is like a few big missions coming up. God, the game goes on for so long, I can't remember all the big stuff that happens. I may need to get a room. some of this fine strawberry air. So you're the expert now. Oh, uh, har hardly. Just making conversation. Forget I said anything. Okay. Nope, I don't want to change clothes. Just wanted to sleep. Hey, there we go. Until um, um noon. Why can't I sleep until morning? Why is that not an option? Coolio, let's head on out. <laughs> Seems like a better way than I need to get out here. Hey there, girl. I need to go and see the general store manager. if you will. Hell fire, you look like death. Uh, what kind of welcome's that? I'd refer you to the doctor, but he hasn't <laughs> been seen in weeks. I'm fine. I'll just buy all the ammo.
No, actually, uh, yeah, let me get that back. It's an old book. Careful with so the I might pages. grab the repeating right, shotgun as well, maybe. Um, all right, where is it? Uh, weapons. Hey, shotguns. Or is it just the one? Ah, oh, it's just the one. What oh, the semi-auto shotgun? That seems like crap. Where's the repeating shotgun? Ah, oh, screw you. Goddamn backwater That's fine, town. Man. Not stocking its guns. This is America. Transport, sir. Mm, Why, well, yes, I am, my good man. Uh, I've been looking at old wheels get you too. She's been gone for hours. Can you help me find her? Man, hold, hold Let me check the map. Where's the closest? Must be Van Horn, right? I think it's Van Horn. Where is this? Nope, never mind. This is actually Annisburg. Okay. Annisburg it is. Annisburg, please. <laughs> oh boy, that'll be quite the fair. Hop in. It's fine, I'm a thousand air. Yeah. Not really, a, I don't think well, that's a thing, is it? Or is please, it? sir. I I'm getting real nervous about her. I must have seemed like a real dick to that guy, because I just got in the the carriage and just left him. And he was like, "Please look after, look. Can you find my sweet girlfriend or wife or whatever?" And I didn't even look at him. I just got in the carriage and went off. Yep, I seem like a like quite the dick. There. There's a gun shop here. Yeah. My repeating uh, shotgun. I think it's a repeating guy. shotgun. Can't you just leave me? You were fine. Hello, sir. This must be your first time. Hmm. Take a look. This must be your first time. Uh, I don't want to sword off. Double barrel pump. Be be be. Ooh, there we are. Can't buy it though. There you go. Oh yeah. Look at that. Thing you know, of a new beauty. stock on this could really improve it. Interested? Very good. How would you feel about a new stock on this one? I could make one for you. Here you go. All the weapons here are regularly maintained and cleaned. The coal dust gets on everything. All right, nice. Now this should be fun. I got, no, that's not what I wanted. Oh my god, I'm in some kind of what? Compendium. There we go. Why does one button do like five different things in this game? When I'm holding down the button, I don't want to end up in like <laughs> a compendium. I'm trying to do it to get the map. Oh, 
Now, my only real question is, am I going the right way? Because this seems like a really... Like a long way around. To get to Charles, but... Uh, it's fine, I should have enough time. Yeah, I should be fine. Really depends how long this takes me, though. Because... Yeah, this path goes right... Up the mountain. I suppose it's a quicker way-ish, I guess. Maybe. It looks sort of like a straight line after I get past Roanoke. Yeah. Oh! Ah, poor guy jumped head first and well, poor girl jumped head first into a tree. I do like the idea that uh, when Arthur fell off the horse, the only thing he managed to grab was the shotgun. Like no, no, no sort of concern for his own personal safety. He just grabbed the shotgun as he went off. You have now entered legendary animal country. Nope. Not doing it. Yeah. I uh, don't mind hunting in this game, but... Ugh. Easy there. Yeah. It's really just to get the trophy, isn't it? Is it... Uh, well, a trophy, I think, if you hunt certain animals, you get special clothing that only hunting can unlock. Uh, satchels and belts and so on. But that's the only reason. Uh, Again, like I said, there's no point in hunting to sell fur and meat and whatnot because none of that stuff, you can't, you can't buy anything with the money you get. Like guns and that's about it. At least in GTA there were businesses you can purchase and so on. But you can't really do that in gear because it goes against the whole you're an outlaw, no ties to anything, etc, etc. Alright, well I think I'm on the um, straight line now towards Rain's Fall, that uh, Rain's Fall, Rain Falls, Rain's Fall, yeah. I think I'm on the straight line towards uh, the camp now, the reservation. Ah, uh, great. Okay, how close am I? Uh, then... Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Ah. If only I could have... <laughs> If only I like, had the ability and like the, the actual program to sort of just cut this out. But as it is, I do my best to try sort of link up the audio with the video. And that can be a bit of a bitch. Uh, sometimes. 
depends. I've gone on PS4, it's a bit easier. Like when I'm doing this now. Uh, but if I try using my capture card and try doing commentary for, say, like an older game, it's uh, much harder. Oh, come on! What the hell? That's twice now I've come off the horse. Yeah, the, the, the jump is also like an automatic thing as well. Which, eh, I'm not fussed about, because sometimes the terrain is a bit uneven and the horse will jump automatically when you don't want it to. Which can lead to moments like that when I'm trying to go uphill and the horse will just jump randomly. Or go over it, like walk into a rock or something. Thank you for coming. Of course. The chief, he's a... Uh, he's very... Maybe you could speak to him? Yes, yes. Why, well, okay. He's in his tent. Joe, I'll wait for you here. Let's go see the chief. Hey, chief. How's it hanging? Hello. How's it going? Come in. All good? You happy? Mr. Morgan. I'm so glad you could make it. How are you? My son. My son is foolish, but he's still my son. I know your son. A little. Yeah. He's very brave. Very angry. <laughs> he's mean. How is your father? He's dead a long time. He yeah. lived a lot longer than was good for any of us. My son probably wishes the same to me. <laughs> I doubt that. I want peace. I need my people to be safe. All my life I've tried to bring peace. But I love my son. They'll hang him for treason. Treason. He is the chief son of a proud nation. How could he commit treason? And people who have lied to my people for a hundred years or more, that's treason. What should I do? I don't think there's much chance reasoning with Colonel Favor. No. And any chance we had, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, has ensured relations between us and the Army are worse than any point in the last five years. I'm sure he means well. But matters are more complex than he understands. Me and Charles will try and rescue your son. No. Yes. Yes. I ain't got much to lose, and you got... I'm doing this. Charles! Where are you? Come on, let's go. We need to get his son back, of course. I just ain't sure how. I've been working on that. I think there's a way. Follow me. All right behind you. Yeah, so there, this is another example of uh, the sort of redemption arc that uh, Arthur goes through in the sort of last part of the game. Because okay, he, he starts like doing stuff he wouldn't have done at this, like, you know, any, at any other point in, in the story. Like if someone asks him for this kind of help at the start, like he said earlier, he would you know, think them weak and so on, pathetic. But now he's like, yeah, okay, I'll do this, I'll go out of my way and help. The army are patrolling help. all the main roads and bridges in and out, but 
If we can get the horses across the river, I found a route that should get us in fairly close. If we wait until late enough, there's a place we should be able to sneak in around the back. Okay, whatever you think. I trust you. No guns, just knives and arrows. If we start making a lot of noise, he'll be dead before we get close to him. Okay. I left two canoes down river, in case we need another way out of there. Okay, good. <laughs> You know, this wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for Dutch. It ain't just on Dutch. We all went along with it. He saw eagle flies burn hot, and he fanned the flames. He's not helping that tribe, he's helping himself. You see that, or you wouldn't have gone to Rain's fall behind his back. I guess I just keep thinking. There must be a way to save the situation. To pull Dutch out of the place he's in. Well... I like Rain's Fall. I don't know, Arthur. Rain's Fall is in a tough situation. And that's for Dutch. <sighs> I gotta try. I own that, at least. You feel that? There's rain on the wind. How does Charles no. get away? I can't remember. I guess I'm about to find Charles. out. I mean, I'm coming up to the end goes, some, man, at some man. point. You get yourself out. You got more to lose. No. Come on. Don't start talking like that. Uh, I didn't tell you before, but... Saw it, Doc. It's pretty bad. <laughs> well, it's gonna get worse. Oh, Arthur. Any day we can die, hmm? We're riding to break an Indian chief's son out of a cavalry fort. We could both die tonight. In a way... It is a gift to know. In a way, you are lucky. Sure don't feel like that. You still have time to make amends. The others, Hosea, Lenny, Sean, all of them, they didn't. And what about the Calendar boys? Both killed trying to escape Blackwater? A more vicious pair of bastards than ever was. And that's all they ever were and will be. Maybe. You're lucky. You got the chance to... to do something better. My guess is maybe that's why you're here now. Either way, just keep your head strong. We're close now. Are you all right? Yeah, I think so. That current's strong. Up here. Follow me. Uh, you were right about the damn rain. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But might help us with sneaking in there. The rain's fall told me there was some retaliation after the meeting with Colonel Favors. Some women were taken. Elders beaten. Bastards. Yeah. This isn't gonna be nice. There it is. Uh, well, this well, uh, do we mess rescue them as well as rains um, eagle flies? Yeah, do we rescue the women or do we leave them there? What's the plan? All right. You ready? Yes. Actually, this seems like a good point to test out the repeating shotgun. Follow me. Patrol group. Hopefully we'll be in and out before they can come back around. I, I haven't actually used this since the start, I don't think. Or maybe when I was hunting with Hosea. Let's deal with those two at the gate first. You take one. I'll take the other. Good. Let's make our way around the back. Stay close to the wall. Careful. There's a guard up there. Mm -hmm. 
He's moving. Come on. Right behind you. Good. Let's keep moving. Wait there. Shh. Wait. Two more. One in the tower, one on the ground. Same as before. You take one, I got the other. I wasn't actually sure he killed him then. Oh uh, well, that was a pretty good shot. This is the spot. Yeah, yeah, wouldn't have thought at the start of this game we'd be, like, as well equipped to sort of take on an army base. But, you know. Now keep moving. Rockstar games have an act of surprising you. We kind of, we kind of did this, I suppose, in the first Red Dead. Careful. Though I'm sure it was more bandit you? camps than soldiers. Good work. Come on. Like, doesn't Javier Squaler or that... The army, maybe? In Mexico? Have like a base you have to sort of Hold attack. Tower. Shh. Come on. We're good. There's a guard out front. You take him. I'll come back right there. The cells should be just down this way. Yep, oh, okay. Yep, he just was gonna push me right out of the way there. No consideration for me. Never get past these guards. Get up that tower and try to distract them. Try to put an arrow into the lantern above that stack of wood over there. Start a fire. Yep, oh, I'll do my best. Tomahawk to the forehead. Ah, oh, nasty. Morgan? Charles, is that you? Look for the keys. You can get me out of here. Got him. Come on. <coughs> Your father sent us. My father, he told you to come and kill guards? No, he didn't say that. He... Of course not. Are you okay? Sure. Enjoy being tortured. Clears the mind. If you say so. Huh, whoa, no. whoa. Uh, I'm fine, I'm fine. <sighs> now is where the fun begins, and I can Damn test out this shot. Wait. Ah! 
usually not my response to knowing I've got a Lancaster repeater, but I really wanted to test the shotgun. Okay, hello. Come on. Let's use this thing. It worked. Come on. Okay, girl. Was that guy dead? I'm sure there was someone on that horse. They're right on us, Arthur. Do something. Yep, there was. You deal with that. I'll get the ah! ready. Ah! Oh, thank you, friend. On my way. Well, we made it this far. Let's get out of here. Don't pick to this. The wish they killed me when they had a chance. Let's just get you to see first. It's like Judge said. They only have power to move out. Well, Judge is a lot of Watch out for the current. This is some swell. This is not a great escape plan, but again, it's crazy enough to w actually work, I guess, in this game. Uh, where? All oh, right, then.
Oh no! Arthur lost his hat. How devastating. I wonder if there's a way in this to actually lock it to first person mode and play the entire game in first person. I wonder if that's even possible. Like there's no, no like instances where you need third person exactly I'd say. It just makes it easier I guess. They might look into that. Yeah, I'm right as rain. How are you? <clears throat> I'll be fine in a day or so. I heal fast. Colonel Favors won't be too happy with your rescue. I guess not. Yeah, you know, there's gonna be a lot more trouble. My father. Even he may have to fight. You won't win. No big fight with them. Shouldn't y'all just run away? Where would we go? I don't know. In front. Let me take you back to your father. Hmm? Thank you. No much. Yeah. Okay, you, there's, there's the horse. The horse is nearby, I think. Yeah, some somewhat nearby. There he is. Okay, where am I going? Uh, where are you, Dutch? My last boy. Ah, I have no idea what that is. Um, I have no well, I have suspicion, but I have no idea what that could be about. Well, anyway, I better call it a day uh, for this part. If uh, my horse is stuck, there we go. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna call it a day here. I think. Hope you've all enjoyed this part and enjoyed the commentary and so on and so forth. I am sort of coming up to the end of the game now, so that's good. Uh, if you guys could leave a like and a comment and hit that subscribe button, that would be greatly appreciated. And wait around for the end screen, you'll also get uh, a couple of suggestions for other stuff, like on my channel, that you might like. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it for now, I think. Until next time, look after yourself, take care, and do carry on gaming. See you soon.